If you have a black bottom pool or colored plaster, you definitely don't want to put anything directly into the plaster. So you want to make sure any shock you put in, um, you put directly into the skimmer. Like this bag of Super Shock here, Super Shock Wave. And you definitely don't want to put conditioner into the skimmer, even though it's supposed to go in there, it has cyanuric acid in it. And a lot of times it'll just bypass the pool filter and blow back into the pool and it'll cause little white stains in the bottom of the pool. So dilute any conditioner you have to add into the pool in a bucket of water until it's fully diluted and then pour it directly into the skimmer. That will avoid any kind of white staining. Uh, make sure tabs never fall onto the plaster. It has acid in it, it'll stain it. And never put any kind of uh, algae ban trichlor, which is the same thing that's actually in the tablets, but it's actually in powdered pellet form for black algae. And you never want to put any of that in a black bottom pool or a vinyl pool. It'll just stain that. Okay, if you have a vinyl pool, you want to take the same precautions as with a black or colored plaster pool. Plus, you want to add two more things. You don't want to use a regular vacuum with wheels, as if this gets caught on the vinyl liner, it could tear it and you are out a few thousand dollars to replace the liner. You don't want to use a algae brush with the steel bristles that will also damage the liner. You just want to just use a regular soft bristle brush and they do sell a vacuum that has uh, brushes on the bottom instead of wheels. You can use that. But I would just recommend throwing in an automatic cleaner like this Wahoo unit made by Zodiac. that will keep the pool really clean. You'll never have to vacuum it and won't have to run into that trouble. So again, those are the extra precautions with a vinyl pool. And one quick note about a vinyl pool and a fiberglass pool regarding the pH. Um, there's not a lot of acid demand because it's not really plastered. So you're going to probably, if you use the tablets, you're going to have your pH pretty low all the time. So you need, might need to pick up some pH up and uh, I'll go ahead and show you some of that. 